All right, guys, so you already know it's your boy Menelik. Another day, another dollar. Um, you know, we out here early, take my nephew to the park. Uh, haven't really took him to the park yet, you know. He's finally growing up, you know, building his little immune system, so that's cool, you know. Um, Y'all see I've been consistent on this YouTube stuff, so, you know, go ahead, leave a like, comment, subscribe, because we come consistent all year. I told you, we're dropping, like, what, two videos a week now? Even three a week sometimes, man? Check out my stuff, man. Drop the drone video. Check out the drone video. I dropped the little Mamiya video of how to load the film. I know the film. Check out that video. I'll be linked in the description below. Well, to start this day... What we're gonna do is play at the park with my nephew and let's see later on. Let's get it. All right, y'all say hi to Jeremiah, my nephew, man. This is the king right here, young prince. This is the boy. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> Good job. Oh. Yep. Yep. Right now I'm actually editing the vlog. I was like, yo, let me show y'all how to make any footage cinematic. It can be any footage. Right now we have my nephew playing at the park. I just came back from there. And first tip to make any footage cinematic is you got to shoot it in a high frame rate. That frame rate could be 60 FPS or 120 FPS, doesn't matter, but it has to be a high frame rate so you can slow it down. Young and had to get it, came up off that pavement. Young and had to get it, came up off that pavement. Young and had to get it, came up off that pavement. Second tip to make any footage cinematic is you got to add the black bars, man, the crop, the top and the bottom. Any movie you've seen, it has a crop. What this crop does is it just instantly makes the viewer think, okay, this is a fucking movie, bro. You know what I'm saying? So the crop is key. The crop is key. Coming up the steps, now we elevating to the top floor, penthouse vacant. To the top floor, house, third thing, not the last, but third thing is sound effects. Sound effects makes your footage cinematic. I personally use Epidemic Sound. It's a great server to get royalty-free music and sound effects for any of your content or anything you need it for. Licensed for free. Well, it's not free. You gotta pay for it monthly, but if you use my code in the bio, my link in the bio, it will be free for a month for you, so use that link in the bio. Number four, this is the fourth thing to make any of your footage cinematic, and that is color grading. Adding a color grade, it just makes it custom, more to your feel, to your mood. If you want it to be a warm day outside, if it is a warm day outside, you want to match that with your color grade, making the temperature warmer, more orangey, it will just match it, like a Breaking Bad, like a Mad Max, and nice and warm. Color grade add to your footage so, so much. I was crushing roll, Michelin on my rim. I was in the cold and the snow with my And that's pretty much it, you know what I'm saying? Back to the vlog. All right, so as my nephew, you know, slides down the slide, plays with sand, um, I just want to really just talk to you guys about, you know, my creative journey so far. You know, what I've, what I've been, um, you know, focused on. I've been really focused on my look magazine, um, trying to do more cinematic little short videos that have some meaning behind it. We're getting a lot of those out, you know what I mean? A lot of those in development and process right now. I'm trying to write my own little, you know, little short cinematic thing. So y'all gonna see a lot of dope stuff. Um, in my last video, when my boy, the artist, Naman Chakras came through, I'm gonna drop like two or three of those freestyles on this channel. So it's gonna be dope to see that. Um, you know what? 
let me just make a little short little little sub to this vlog i want to talk about that studio i went to the like around two weeks ago i think around two weeks ago that studio was so dope it was called soul atelier i'm pretty sure that's how you pronounce it but it was a super dope studio the person that runs the studio is an interior designer so she knows what's good like from the couch to the tones to just where everything was placed like it gave me the a real like yeezy vibe like bro like it gave me the yeezy tones you know what i'm saying though that like that that sand that um that that, that neutral that opaque you know the off-white feel you know what i'm saying which I love, and I and I made sure to match that tone with my outfit. I came with the the brown fussy shirt, you know what I'm saying? Even the brown Nike socks, you know what I'm saying? So yeah, it was a dope studio, man. I'm trying to go to more studios in the city of Toronto, even in Brampton, you know what I'm saying? And just do, do some work in there, really. What's good, y'all? Another day, another dollar. Today's a little, you know, a little crappy weather, to be honest. Left the crib right now. Check the mailbox. There is a parcel in here. Um, I honestly do not know what this is, but we're gonna find out soon. All right, don't mind the messy desk, but we got the package right here. Let's see what it is. My Kodak Portra 400, the best color film, man. And this is my last film order that I got developed. Nice film, man. And other than that, um, I got the photos printed, like I said in that video. Got my boy Jordan right here. Nice print of my boy Jordan right here. Got that print and got this right here. This is one of my favorites, personally. I'm trying to get this framed up, but there's a lockdown. Stay at home order, so you can't even buy any like non-essential things so i can't even buy a picture frame so these are going to be sitting here for a little bit but once they get framed up i'm going to show you and we might just hang it up right here in this corner i'm gonna hang it up right here you know add up to the room make it a little bit more you know nice we got this photo of me right here this photo of me so i gotta add some you know some new things to the walls but other than that, it's time to edit some more content. So I'll see you guys next time. Vlog number, I think, four, if I'm not mistaken, maybe three. But we out. Peace. I like getting money, I got time to get it Target on me, so my car's a tenny Dancing with the devil, I don't bargain with it Bobbing in the dash and the stick is with it